Okay, this is a GECB radio transceiver that I modified and I added this line in plug and that goes to yeah this radio and when I got them they had no antenna so I decided, I decided to modify it It goes pretty loud and to prove that I'm listening to the radio. It goes pretty loud and the sound quality is actually pretty good. Alright, now let me show you what I did to rig this. Now as you can see that there's something extra there. This wire, which is the ground. And that white wire goes to the volume control. Now I gotta give a big thanks to both All American 5 Radio and Kit K for the volume control hack. As all American Five Radio mentioned, that you can hack into a volume control this way, and also Kip K did the same thing on his transistorize your iPod video. So I just tap into the volume control, and I did that here. So thanks both of you. I added this headphone jack, which I got from an old Walkman circuit board, which didn't work. Couldn't get it to start up. So I did this. And as you can see, it fits pretty good. So I'm just fire it up. There we go, we can never laugh. Oh, you fucking slabs out here. As you can see, it still transmits. I don't know if it actually works, and frankly, I really don't give a shit. I just wanted to use this powerful audio system thing to play the music from radio or MP3 player or your iPod, whichever. Another cool thing, and this is going to go in the other video. When I was getting ready to transfer the videos from my camera to my computer, this thing was on my desk, and I moved my mouse and I heard this. Oh, hurry up, you piece of shit. Yeah. Apparently my wireless mouse apparently operates on the CB frequencies. So if you take a CB, any CB radio, put it to that channel, channel 7, and then you'll need a wireless a micro innovations wireless optical mouse 
but any mouse might might use the same frequency. I'm not really sure, but this is just trying on this one. That's clicking. That's right clicking. Right clicking. And this is a scroll wheel. Turn the squelch up. You don't hear it. But if I put my finger on the antenna connector, it works. So there, another discovery there.